the stem stitched moon. Before we start to stitch the moon, let us look at stem stitch and practice. Stem stitch is one of my favourite stitches and it is a very useful stitch. It can be used both as an outline and a fill-in stitch. A line worked in stem stitch is more fluid than one worked in back stitch or double running stitch. It easily curves and is perfect for stitching vines and outlines. I always think of the saying, two steps forward and one step back when working a stem stitch, as it consists of one long stitch forward and a short stitch back. I tend to go forward by four threads and back by two, but this does vary with what I am stitching. Nothing is ever cast in stone when you work with your needle. When working from left to right, the thread should be kept below the needle and when working from right to left, above the needle. This is important to create a rope-like effect. Do not be afraid to move your frame and hoop around as you are working this stitch. Time spent understanding the mechanics of the stem stitch and exploring the effects that can be achieved with the stitch will open the doors for you to many samplers. We will stitch the outline of the moon first and then we will stitch out a guideline to help us contour our stitches. I stitched out the contour guideline by eye. You might prefer to use a pencil to mark out the line. When you come to stitch Esther's sampler, you should use what we have learnt in our workshop project and approach the tree of knowledge in the same way as this moon. Stitch out the outline of the trunk and branches first. Then draw or stitch out some contour lines. The trunk may require more than one line. Think of the shape and how it flows upwards. Think about what you want to recreate. You can see how I achieved movement and fluidity in this piece. using a waist knot for this motif, but if I was stitching for myself, I would have used a pin stitch.
The moon I have stitched and the apples I will be stitching shortly have a different texture to those the model stitcher created. I have laid my stitches to sit closer together. It is only by practicing the stitch that you will find the way to achieve the effect that appeals to you the most.